welcome to Let's Play Gran Turismo 4 Part 40! And back to the dirt we go. So, uh, let's just get back in my Toyota RC. Because, you know, that's my dirt car for the normal rallies and shit. And shit. So, let's just go do it. <laughs> God damn it. For some reason, I still haven't recovered from this very slight illness I got a couple weeks ago. It's pissing me off. Anyway, Swiss Alps, Alps, Alps Rally. Let's just get started. Right, well, here we go. My opponent is the Ford RS200. Oh, boy. Well, let's get this bitch started. Ten point race. Hey. I don't know. can never tell with this game. Like I've said many a time, so I'm not going to judge by that. Might be able to do well considering I have more experience with this circuit because it's actually carried over from GT3. Surprise, surprise. Also, if the uh, video looks a little different, I am uh, I, I decided to switch to 480p instead of 1080i for recording the races. I'm still running this shit in 720p because I'm gay. But, um, yeah. Switching to 480p in-game resolution to see how it looks. I actually did a little test recording the night before, and it turned out pretty well, so, uh... Why did I never try this before? Am I retarded? Wait, yes, I am. I'm really surprised I didn't try this before, because that's the fucking in-game resolution that Forza is in, and that turns out pretty fucking well, looking well. So why did I never put two and two together? Until now. I don't fucking know. Anyways. I am dominating this race. Alright. Whatever. Oh, oh, don't spin. Don't spin. Alright. Almost spun it around. That would have been disastrous. Kind of. I mean, I'm dominating this race, so it wouldn't have been that bad. But yeah. Two laps to go. Eh. Careful. Wait. turn is so much tighter than it seems. I don't know why or how, but oh god, what am I doing? I look away for just a split second and here I am going nose first into the wall. Really all I need to do is just kind of drive carefully. Considering, uh, yeah, the RS-200 is definitely not putting up any kind of a fight. We... Speed, holy shit. Alright. And one lap to go. Until, you know, up till GT5, it was literally impossible to flip your car over in this series. And they kind of just allowed that to happen in GT5. I'm sure they'll allow it in GT6 as well. GT6 
GT6 I am actually quite excited for. It doesn't look like they're going to change a lot from GT5. It's more just like, hey, GT5 with additional content. But... I would probably be somewhat of a hypocrite if I said that was a stupid idea because I really liked Saints Row 4 and that's basically Saints Row 3 with additional content. So yeah. I'm sorry, Saints Row the Third, it's not Saints Row 3. <laughs> Titles. I am 21 seconds ahead of this fucking RS, alright. Well, I think it's safe to say that he's not definitely not gonna make it to the finish before the fade. That's for goddamn sure. But let's wait it out and see if he actually does. I know he's not going to, but fuck. I'm gonna wait it out anyways, damn it. Ah, uh, skip the replay. Do do, give me that 10,000 credits. And to the reverse course. Alright, well, here. Oh, no. This is not going to end well, is it? Going against the fucking... No. Alright, might have to uh, swap cars again. Because fuck this game. There's no way I'm going to beat this impressive with this car. So I'm kind of driving like shit right now. Whee! Well, kind of staying behind him, kind of. Not gaining on him, really. Except right here. Alright, this might actually be possible for some strange reason. Or I could just go insanely wide through here and just uh, eliminate any and all progress I just made. Good stuff. Alright, this isn't gonna happen. go in case I pull something out of my ass, but I don't see this happening. Oh, oh. What the hell kind of line was that, you idiot? That was the worst line I've ever seen. Oh, fuck. Well then. Like, that was the least optimized fucking line through that turn I've ever seen. What the fucking shit, game. I don't know, but I have a chance of winning now. Or still. Ah. But hey, fucking turned down into me. Asshole. Alright, goddamn penalties. Ooh. Going very wide, hitting the fence. Almost hitting the Impreza again. That was actually quite close. Okay. Let's not really fuck up this turn this time. I did not, good. Good exit off of here. That was a pretty good exit, I think. Maybe. I don't know. Perhaps. Wait. I'm under a second. So. 
I did something right. Are you gonna take the world's worst line through there? Yeah, you are. Okay. I'm just gonna duck underneath and easily take the lead. Alright, final lap. Ooh, actually got it slowed down this time. I'm going too fast. <clears throat> the hell is he? Oh. Apparently he's uh, lost some time to me. Okay. Through that section. Can't fucking see him, but I can see his dot on the map, and I guess that's good enough. Well, this is definitely going to be a surprise victory for me. I I was genuinely, like, genuinely, like, <laughs> doubtful of my uh, chance of victory with this car against the fucking Impreza Rally car. But I just have one more turn to go, and uh, victory is mine in my first attempt at that. There we go. I went the normal Alps Rally. By 3.2 seconds. <laughs> nice. Alright. Well, that went surprisingly well. Surprisingly well. So, another 10,000 credits and prize car time. Yeah. Here we go. What am I going to win? Uh, Selva GT4 rally car. That's the little asshole that plagued me at fucking. What was it, Ice Arena? I think it was Ice Arena. Fucking asshole. There we go. With the normal Swiss Alps rally. Yay! Bada bing. So let's just check out the Celica. Got another 0.3% towards my game completion. And there we go, 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 go we there, 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 go, go, there. Alright, stay tuned for more rally.